Your front locator, what's best on your front locator? Regular sonar or chirp? Good morning, guys and girls. Good morning. July 21, reading from a Catch a Better Life book. Uh, this book's available at Bass Pro Shop, Cabela's, Barnes & Noble, Hobby Lobby, Amazon, JimmyHouston.com. July 21, we're uh, looking at Psalm 39.1, and it says, I will guard my ways, lest I sin with my tongue. Yeah, lest I sin with my tongue. At the 2019 FLW tournament on Lake Toho and Kissimmee, Chris and I had a fairly tough practice. Three days, we practiced pretty tough. Only one small area on Cypress Lake produced quite a few fish. We had one little area that we caught several. If many found that area, it certainly would not hold up for the full event. It just gonna, very many people, if I had to share that fi those fish with very many people, it just wasn't gonna work. We had uh, observers, so we didn't have to worry about a co-angler catching fish. To my surprise and to my great joy, I was the only one fishing that area. And I won money, I won over $10,000 on a combination of sinking worms, spinner baits, and flipping. I caught a little bit on all of the above and, and, and got a good check, did real good. I caught some really nice fish, some big fish and nice stringers of fish. I guarded that little area, I guarded that little area, and I guarded that little area, and it really paid off. There's another thing that must be guarded. Yeah, our tongues. We must be guarded, our tongues. It's all but impossible. Can I say that again? It's all but impossible to not sin with our tongues. We sin with our tongues probably more than anything else. This scripture tells us how to avoid sinning with our tongues. We guard our ways. We guard our feelings. We guard our anger. And we guard how we act around those who are against us. How we act around our enemies, our foes, the people we don't like, people don't like us. We guard how we act around them. We guard how we talk about them. When our feelings start taking over, we just simply zip it up. We zip it up. We put a muzzle on our mouths. Remember, words are like bullets. Once fired, we can't take them back. Once fired, we can't take them back. Like pointing a gun at somebody and shooting them. And they can be just as deadly as pointing a gun at somebody and shooting them. So let's guard our ways and let's guard our tongues today. You know, the easiest way to really do that, i found, is when we open our mouth around other people, let's just try to say something nice. Try to say something positive. Try to say something good about somebody. If somebody's talking in a conversation and they're talking bad about old Bill and how old Bill does this and Bill does that and Bill does that, and you say, you know, I, I like old Bill to death. I love him like a brother. Him and I fished together one time and I, I beat him like I beat him like crazy, you know, but he was letting me, he would let me throw first in front of the boat. You know, if we say something nice about somebody, if we say something edifying, if we say something positive to somebody, that's the best way to keep from sinning with our tongues. Here's our tip for today, and it's a good one. Regular sonar shows more water than chirp. Regular sonar shows more water than chirp. So it's best to use regular sonar on your front locator rather than chirp. So your front fish finder, you're a lot better off having that fish finder set on a regular view as opposed to having it set on chirp. Guys and girls, go out there and have you a great one today. And remember, I sure do love you. Say something good about somebody. I'm going to tell you what, I'll just end this by saying, not only do I love you, y'all the greatest folks in the world. <laughs>